Okay, hi there. Let me just, I'm going to walk you through the process of the issue that you're having. So what I'm going to do when you're part here, I've actually, so your part starting here, I'm going to roll back to your uh, cut extrude at this location. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the cut extrude and edit it. And what we want to do is we want to leave your, the two on the outside, but I don't want this one. So I'm not going to bother deleting it. I'm just going to go into select contours here and I'll select this one and I'll select this one and just leave it to go through all. All right, so this sketch you from here. And now if I go down, everything's right till this point. So what you need to do, you have this sketch created on this plane. You really don't want it on that plane. So I'm going to go ahead and delete this sketch. Actually, what I'll actually do before I even delete that sketch, let me, um, I'll click on it and I'm going to change, I'm going to edit the sketch plane to be your mid plane here. And I think your mid plane is the top plane. So I'll say okay for that. And now let me go ahead and edit that sketch. I haven't taken a look at whether or not you have it defined correctly. And you do. I mean, everything else is fine. You're, you're good here. You have the sketch defined at 50 and at 75. Perfect. And you have the diameter. So all you need to do now is, so let me say, well, I'll just start from in here. So I'll do an extruded cut. Features, extruded cut. And in this case, I forget now. So it's a distance of 20. So that's what we'll do. We'll do an extruded cut. We'll make the distance 20. And it's got to go from the mid plane. Okay. So then we'll just say, okay. So what you were missing was the fact that it was a curved cut. So let me actually show you that. If we go to or do a section view, and we select the, uh, the top plane. And then we do the view from here. And now you see that that mimics the view here on section, oh, I don't think you can see that, um, on section AA. So you were very, very close. That was the only thing that you needed to do. So if I go here and bring the part out and let's verify that the, um, the, the mass properties are the same. So the mass properties here, as I have written down, um, 1929.12. Yep, so you were very close. Um, you just kind of had the, uh, the sketch on the wrong plane. All right, hope this helps.